Hey guys, this is Tony with Six Side Gear. We're a couple days away from elk season getting started, so we wanted to go through the pack out of the clothing that we take back into the woods for our hunt. Uh, this is our Rana Gray line. We find Rana Gray to be ideal for the elk woods, whether you're in timber, high country, blowdown areas. Uh, these colors and patterns really tend to do very, very well. First off, um, an item that you're always going to be wanting to take me in is a soft shell jacket. As far as this jacket goes, uh, features and benefits of it, it is our soft shell material. Multiple zippers, you're going to have access on your chest pocket, over on the shoulder. You've got a zipper pocket specifically for your rangefinder with a D-ring so you can attach it there. One of the most annoying things whenever you're walking in is you can get your body temperature up and trying to cool off without taking your pack off and peeling layers. What we did is we went ahead and incorporated some body heat extraction vents. These are going to be underneath the arms. So as you're hiking in, you can release a lot of your body heat out without having to completely take all your gear off. September, for the most part, is going to start out in the 30s, 40s in a lot of states, and it can get pretty hot by mid-afternoon. Our lightweight pants, these are the ones that we're going to recommend. We offer our Rana Gray pants in lightweight as well as soft shell. We tend to suggest our soft shell pants more for a late season, whenever it is cold or more snow on the ground. So these are actually the pants that I will be taking in. We offer our pants in regular and long inseam lengths. So if you're 6'3 or above, we generally are gonna recommend our, uh, our long length for the pants there. We've got a couple performance tees. These are 100% polyester. Uh, they do have some stretch to them. They're gonna breathe really, really well. Uh, we have a short sleeve and a long sleeve. They're fantastic for layering, especially whenever it's not cold enough to justify you know, a wool base layer, something that really is gonna get extremely uncomfortable by mid-afternoon. I bring both of them in, short sleeve and long sleeve. If the morning starts out really cold, then I'll do a long sleeve underneath, then the short sleeve, and then my soft shell jacket. Really makes peeling layers a lot easier. So now we've also got our rain gear pants. Uh, features and benefits of these, we've got rubberized zippers, so you are still able to access the pants pocket. You've got an adjustable belt that is going to lock down so you can cinch these down and over your pants. We've incorporated a zipper on them that's going to go up to your knee so that you're going to be able to take these on and off without taking your boots off. When you're going in in the mornings, a lot of times there's dew in these fields. Uh, it can get your pants extremely wet. Even if it's not raining, a lot of the times we'll just go ahead and put the rain gear pants on when we're hiking in in the morning, especially when the sun's coming up, and then peel these off by the time, you know, probably the first hour or so of sunlight. Uh, we've got our neck gaiter in Rana Gray as well. Whether it's for keeping your neck warm in the mornings or concealing your face if you're really close in on a stalk, love these. And same goes with our Rana Gray hat. All right, y'all, thanks for watching. If you have any questions about any of this gear that you see or suggestions for your next hunt, give us a call, 1-833-6-SITE.